Just I pretend. wish I had been involved in the Megan and Harry leave Spotify negotiation. <laughs> the f-ing grifters. That's the podcast we should have launched with them. A media group owned by Prince Harry and Meghan Markle named Archwell Audio has agreed to end its deal with Spotify. Her and Harry had a $20 million deal with Spotify to put out material, but apparently due to failing to meet the productivity benchmarks, <laughs> <coughs> lazy, <coughs> they have failed to renew it for a second season and she won't be getting that full payment. So that was a very expensive few episodes to put out. The interpretation of grifters as con artists has not gone down very well, I suspect, with the Sussexes. But the problems are, firstly, there's little doubt Spotify and the Sussexes and Megan didn't with archetypes make the impression that uh, they were looking for and clearly this has been a failure. It's it's difficult to see where they go from here because the, the talk is that they will use another streaming service. No doubt they're still a big name, people will want to work for them. It's a bit of a bump in the road that they probably could have done without. And and maybe they'll have a bit of a reassessment to see where they go next. of that yes. uh, Netflix their deal with Netflix is also <gasps> under oh. uh, under jeopardy in jeopardy because apparently this documentary that they were making about injured veterans has become more about Megan than oh. about the veterans shock me mm-hmm. 